What's the temperature outside? Right now, it's 19 degrees Fahrenheit. Today, expect a high of 40 degrees. What's going on, y'all? Your boy out doing this morning routine. Look at that. It's cold this morning. 19 degrees out, it's not that bad. It's not that bad. It's not windy, that's a good thing. Hey, so let me give y'all a little bit of an update this morning before we go out and do our morning walk. So I took Penny out yesterday. Had some problems with her yesterday. She hit her 10, uh, 10 hour mark. I put fuel in her for the first time. Uh, got a flat tire. Don't know if that's right, but hey, I went ahead and plugged it. So if that's not right, somebody let me know. But it's fixed. And then check this out. So Yesterday, while I was using the box blade, this came loose twice on me. I lost two pins right there yesterday. So, I think it was this one? Just yesterday alone. So I stopped because I figured it must have been too muddy. I also used this, this fuel can yesterday. Hey, some of y'all saw that video yesterday. So these are the fuel cans they sell here. That boy wasn't supposed to be out till uh, March 1st, so y'all be seeing that again. <laughs> hey, but, um, Basically, I had some problems. Penny got a flat tire yesterday. Uh, and my three-point hitch, it doesn't seem to be working properly. So, that's a little bit of my update on what happened with Penny. But let me show you how this yard. Because what Penny has done in the yard has been amazing. So, I'm going to take y'all on this walk. Let's go through my favorite trail first because I know y'all saw that video. So, I'm going to be walking back to where I burned. But, uh... That box blade, it did pretty good. Let's get to walking. Hey, yeah, it's, it's cold this morning and it's a lot of frost. But let me show y'all what these trails look like now because I did bring the box blade out yesterday and I had a good time with it yesterday. So let's go ahead and start with this trail over here. If you can't tell, I drug a lot of stuff out of here. But wait till you see these trails today. Hey, the ground is frozen solid today. It's cold out. But look at the trail, man. This is great. So I got most of the tripping hazards out. I busted up most of this area. It's real smooth. I mean, I didn't do use the box blade as good as I could have. I didn't get to use it on all the different settings because the pin broke twice or fell out twice. I don't know. But uh, it's smoothing out nicely i mean it doesn't feel like nearly as many tripping hazards or high spots in the middle uh, i brought the four-wheeler out yesterday and i'm gonna be honest the four-wheeler went a lot smoother on the trails actually too smooth because the trails were so smooth yesterday after i got done uh the four-wheeler seems like it wants to go a lot faster because it's nothing slowing it down like no bumps for me to brace for uh the box blade did good it did very good I mean, I don't know where to show y'all that it did the best, but I'm saying I was happy to come out here and show y'all. Look at this, though. This is the type of stuff that it ripped up out the ground that I'm going to have to come back with, probably a pickaxe or something to break it up. See, stuff like that came just ripped up out the ground. And it did a good job through here, though. It did real good on that part, especially. Four-wheeler loves that now. And this area right here, the tractor loves this. And see what I noticed after dragging it with the box blade yesterday, now there's almost nowhere that I'm worried about the tractor getting stuck. And the reason I say that is because I drugged this with the box blade yesterday and it was muddy, especially right here. This is the muddiest area. And I'm saying, look today, there's no mud here whatsoever. And I ran the four wheeler through it and I ran the tractor through it. So, I mean, there's no mud because it didn't, it's no water. But I'm saying today was the first day I was able to come out 
and not be worried about mud on the property. So, I'm happy with this. I'm happy with what the box blade did. I'm gonna leave that right there. I'll come back and burn that after I get done with this video. Uh, yeah, it's cold out, 19 degrees, but this don't bother me. I'm still gonna get my, look at that. Ooh wee. My first little ice bucket. Ooh, ooh, ooh. It ain't that frozen. <laughs> but uh, let me show you a little bit more of what, what I did with the box plate yesterday. I came through here with it. You can tell where it busted everything up. So I'll be picking this stuff out. They did a good job breaking that up. I came through this area right here. It did a good job on this. Uh, you see where it, it caught roots and just busted them up. Just like that one. And I'll come out and clean those out. Eventually, it's gonna be, I'm gonna be able to come out here with the, uh, with a tiller and till all this up really good. But right now, rocks and uh, and roots are getting in the way, and I don't want to hit those with the tiller. So those scar fires are really breaking it up really nice, and it's moving the dirt to better spots. So this is what the trails look like today after running the box blade all day yesterday. And I showed you what problems I had. I had to put it away twice because uh, I kept losing pins. I think it was just because it was too muddy out. Uh, I'll try it again when it's not so muddy and see if I have any better luck. I also need to look and see if the box blade or the three point uh, is set up correctly. I could have set it up wrong, I don't know. But I went back and I bought uh, some spares yesterday. So I bought three and I've already lost one of the three that I bought, so I have two left. So that is a good thing that I got some extras. All right, so this is the morning walk. I appreciate everybody giving me information and input. Uh, the more I use Penny, the better I get with her. The more comfortable I get with her, that is true. I thank y'all for telling me that because, because of y'all, I have been out here uh, using her more often. I'm saying the videos are coming. Most of my tractor videos will be coming out on Fridays. And then things that I do with the family or the barbershop, those will be coming out Mondays and Wednesdays. Cause I don't want to overwhelm people with tractor videos. But uh, <laughs> Penny is playing a big part in my life right now and I am enjoying it. This is why I do it though, because I got her. Oh, so this is some of the size of rocks that I got out yesterday. I got some big ones out, real big ones. But uh, this is my morning walk. This is a little bit of an update of what Penny did. Like I said, she hit her 10 hour mark yesterday. Uh, I did pressure wash yesterday. I had to find the uh, the hole in the tire. Oh, this area right here is starting to flatten out pretty good. I don't worry about the tractor tipping right here anymore. It used to be real, real steep. Now, clearly it's not nearly as steep as it used to be. So that's working out well. And everything's working out well. Uh, today's Sunday. Oh, let me not forget. I want to make sure I show you my step count for the day yesterday. I'm on, I should be at a 12 day goal. I've been putting it up on my Instagram. Um, so far today, I got 1,147 steps. So that's my step count goal. I will be trying to post what my steps were every day for the day prior and what I slept like because I didn't get to sleep early last night. I could not go to sleep. So I'm gonna put how well I slept, show my heart rate, and I will be showing my step count from yesterday. And if you have your step count or you know it or you're, in, you're watching me because you wanna stay active and that's the reason why you follow, make sure you leave your step count below. I'm trying my best to make sure that I do something to keep people motivated to be active. I'm not saying that I'm in the gym working out. What I'm saying is even these steps that I'm accumulating right now, they're helping me. And I try my best to stay active. So I'm out on my morning walk this morning. 
I'm about to get some paper burned. Just wanted to make sure I give everybody an update. I want to thank everybody who's been rocking with me and giving me input. I will be trying to dig trenches for water to run along uh, in the future. But problem is, is I'm still learning Penny and what I'm trying to do. So for now, I think this is it. Got me a little morning walk in. Got to see what was going on in the trails. I do that every day. And now... I'm about to get to burning this stuff, warm up, and then I'm going to probably throw some of this stuff in the, in the fire as well this morning. A little bit every day gets the job done. Don't try and get it done all at once. I got that boy crammed. I just do a little bit every day. So, hey, this is another morning walk. Much respect to everybody. I love everybody who supports me and who's been watching me. Um... Basically, I ain't got much else to say. I think this was ran long enough. I think I updated y'all on everything. Can't think of one thing that I missed. Um, oh yeah, me and the wife went to Costco yesterday. <laughs> oh, that looked tight right there, didn't it? <laughs> hey, that boy going, and that boy gone. <laughs> hey, this your boy. And I'm out. Hey, I got a flat tire right there.